Welcome to the Freedom Unchained channel. I got a comment I want to go over. It says, just a funny fact to add is that gravity isn't a law. Because it's still a theory. You said the law of gravity, but it's still technically a theory. It's sort of impossible to use the scientific method, test invisible an invisible force. I'm gonna have to read this my own way so you guys can get a little understanding of what he's trying to say. So he's trying to say, it's impossible to use a scientific method to test a invisible force under cert certain conditions, which would have to be shown and measured, be qualified a law. It says, yes, you can describe how it works using math, physics, and calculus, and astronomy. So that's why it's still a theory. You can fact check this pretty easily. It's funny how people think that it's a law because it's spoken. Because it's spoken of a lot as if it is a law. Sorry for if that was hard to understand. I'm not gonna give him a hard time because I don't write clearly in my comments because it's just a fucking comment. I hate the libtards that come on and expect you to have perfect grammar, perfect spelling, and make their lives easy because that's all they have to do in life is to troll people in their comments. So I'm not going to do that. But what I want to say, the law, it's not a law just because man can't understand it. It's a law because it's how the world works. There's an idea of, or a saying, there's things you know you know, there's things you know you don't know, and there's things you don't know you don't know. And the law can be found in all of those. Even the things you don't know you don't know are still laws. Laws, or judges in the legal system, so the Supreme Court, they're basing all of the, you know, the rights when they're, when somebody is trying to f claim that the government has trampled on their rights. The higher courts are giving their opinion on law, their opinion on the inalienable rights, the opinion on the unimmutable rights. Those are unimmutable laws. That's why I say true law, man cannot make law, only it comes from source, or God, or whatever you want to call it. I believe there is a collective consciousness weaving, woven in between everything that we see, feel, can't see, can't feel. The real world, the spiritual world, there is a spiritual world, but just because man can't understand something doesn't make it not a law. That is the thing in life, is that there's many things that we don't understand. Principles that we need to un learn to understand to make life easier. And life will be difficult if we want to live life acting like we don't have to abide by these invisible laws that we don't understand. If you want to be lazy and not try to figure out the best path to live your life, the best way to live your life, trying to live within the laws, the true laws, and you're going to have a hard time in this world. I know this channel is mainly focused on how to get yourself out of the control of the government and how to act in a court, but all a court is is two parties come together to figure out the law, the truth, bring facts, tangible things that they could bring into the court, the battlefield, the arena, whatever you want to call it, a fictional playing field, the things that we do know to come to the best understanding of law, of what is right. That's all I wanted to say about that comment. 
So gravity is a law because it, it's around us, it affects us. Some people might not be sure of what it is. If man could understand what gravity is, they might be able to use it or rise above it and use other laws to maybe make flying cars. But just because man comes up with the ability to make flying cars doesn't mean gravity doesn't exist or gravity isn't a law. It's still a law you have to use or work within. I hope that makes sense and that I'm not just rambling. I hope you guys enjoyed that. Please subscribe to the channel if you like content like this. Please like the video, share the video around, leave a comment, let's get a conversation started. And until next time, I'm going to leave you guys in love and the light with the one infinite creator. Peace.